guys, it's Elijah here with Elijah Dirk's Vlogs, and this is what I bring when I go traveling. <laughs> you see his balls? <laughs> <laughs> So I'll start with what I use for my camera equipment and everything. So with a trip like this, I'm going to be super compact, always on the move. It's run and gun filming and photography. So therefore, I can't have, you know, Ronins or big drones and a lot of that equipment. So I keep it super basic and super simple, but still enough that I can capture the good quality I want. So starting off with cameras, I have my Nikon D610. This camera is amazing along with the uh, Nikon D610 uh, grip. This thing shoots incredible video uh, 1080p at 60 frames per second and um, it's it's really good for the price range this grip is just essential it increases my battery life enormously here's another extra battery that slips in the bottom for that that I have in here this bag has all my wires and everything else necessary to uh, charge all my things so I have my my MacBook here where it's so vital to have this on the go because I can edit and get my vlogs out and videos like this put together along with cinematics and stuff like that. Always dumping stuff onto there. And then with all what everything you shoot, gotta have hard drives. This is my Seagate 4 terabyte hard drive. This thing is a beast. I mean I filled about two terabytes full of uh, footage and f photos on here and I have it all backed up onto another hard drive that I'll leave here at home. But never leave without these. These are vital. Then um, to, to, uh, this is actually a really cool, this is a solar panel um, power bank and then here's just another little power bank. These are great to have, charge your phone and different stuff. Charger for the big camera battery, uh, plug in for the MacBook and then of course you gotta have one of these, power adapter. This gives me all of Europe and Australia and it also gives me um, Asia and the Philippines and those land areas there, which is really great. All my wires again. Um, also back here, this is my SD card case. It's a waterproof case. It's also cushioned so I can drop it and I have uh, 12 SD cards. Fits all in here. Really nice. Never go anywhere without a speaker. And this UE Boom speaker, I cannot recommend enough. It is so great. The volume and the sound quality is off the charts and it lasts for 8 hours charge and it's waterproof. I mean, can, it cannot get better than this. This is amazing speaker, great for travel. I have for a lens for my Nikon body, I have the uh, Tamron 24 to 70 millimeter f-stop of 2.8. This thing is a great lens. This is my my go-to lens. This is like the lens I use 95% of the time. It is fantastic. I also have this 50 millimeter portrait lens. This thing's so great for taking por portraits and just nice little really blur up the background, get that shallow depth of feel. Love this. Uh, this is at a f of uh, 1.4. So it's a good lens. So they're all Nikon Pro Series lens lenses, which is nice. Polaroid camera and some Polaroid film. I love having that instant gratification of a photo and sometimes there's just you just need that in that situation and so that's what that's for. Truly a great thing. Uh, passport. Gotta have a passport, get everywhere. Uh, padlock, lock up all the stuff at night in the hostels or wherever you are. And this is super important, guys. I always bring a notebook, a brand new one, and I write in it to, uh, stories, just tell myself, you know, remind myself, come up with a film idea or a photo idea, jot it down in here. And y'all know how much I love pineapples, so it's fitting. And this, this is the Roving Blue. I've talked about it before, and I'll be doing another video on it. This thing is the best. I will not leave home without this. This is a water purification thing and it is fantastic. I can purify any amount of water no matter what. It is so great. I'm going with a bunch of Roving Blue business cards because I'm an ambassador for their company. And I'm also going with just a big stack of my business cards for all my social media platforms. So if you're in Europe, I'll probably hand you one of these if we meet. GoPro and sticker bombed Contigo water bottle. Gotta have a water bottle. That's like travel hack number one. Water costs way, way too much in airports. And you can go in the airport, bring that in empty, and fill it up once you get inside. Just a bubble or whatever. That's like the way to go. 
In here, I have my GoPro case with my GoPro Hero 3. Older GoPro, but still nice. I also have uh, fairy lights for photos and remotes and different wires and stuff in here. Um, this is really great. I can shove this in my bag. Keeps everything super organized and clean. Have a waterproof sack. Always bring a waterproof sack through all your electronics. So say if I'm out in a canoe or something out in Switzerland, right? I can just throw all my stuff that I'm not using in that. So if we tip over, no big deal. It's all right there. It's still waterproof. We're good. I'm just a little cold. In here, I have a uh, majority of my clothes actually are packed away. So what I recommend if you go traveling, you know, it doesn't matter if you're traveling for six weeks, six months, or six years, you're going to pack the same amount of stuff. Because your clothing, if it wears down, you can always buy new clothing. That's, that's the motto. But everything I need in here, I just have. So I have my windbreaker, a thing of Under Armour, and um, a pair of shorts and swim trunks in there. And I have two pairs of pants and one pair of shorts. shorts. And then I have uh, three shirts and four pairs of underwear. And then I have a hat, gloves, and a handkerchief. And that's all my clothes that I'm bringing, plus the sweater, which I'll be wearing on the plane. And that's another travel hack. Wear lots of layers because airports are notorious for their like change in temperature. It's like one minute you're like doing really great and you're super warm, the next minute you're freezing cold. So super important. I have here is travel towels, essential, very small, compact. Here I have my headlamp for at night, compass, all my toiletries, utensils, hair ties, because I got that long hair, bro. I'm going to be bringing two pairs of shoes. I'm going to be bringing these shoes, these Converse. I love Converse. Super nice. And then I'll be bringing a pair of Toms to slip on. And the two backpacks I use is the Osprey uh, Crestal 38 liter backpack, camping backpack, backpacking, backpack, 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 right? And then the Langley camera backpack, which is, I cannot go on about enough. It is freaking amazing. It is water durable. It's so great. It's so, I love it. And then uh, last but not least, I've got the Joby Gorillapod. Great for setting up a photo. That way I don't have to bring a whole tripod. And also this is just great for vlogging to get that extra arm, that length outwards. And then in addition to all this, I have three other things that I still have. I will be bringing one of these. Penny board, super important. Have a penny board around. Um, great for getting in airports. When I'm in Chicago Hair and AMS and I need to catch a plane, those, those airports are huge. This will help me get to wherever my plane is super fast and quick. Very important, very vital. Smooth. But I love that. It's important to me. And then the other thing I have that I, you can't see right now is actually uh, what I'm recording this on now. That's my vlog camera along with my new Tamron 17 to 55 millimeter lens. That thing is a beast. Super crystal clear now. It's so great on my D3200 and it's not heavy enough or too heavy that it affects my vlogging at all. Along with the uh, Rode Micro Mic, which is such a great deal. Definitely check out Rode Mic guys. Absolutely love them. Basically guys, that's everything I'll be taking to Europe. It is super compact, super light. And if you guys want me to go more in depth, leave some comments. Um, I have all the things that I have here for the technology and photography side are linked below underneath in my comments. Any questions about that, feel free to ask. Hit me up on Instagram through the DM or something. You know, slide in them DMs, boy. But um, yeah, I'm going to be gone for six weeks. So this is what I would bring. And this is what I will be bringing. Um, hope you guys enjoyed this uh, little segment. Let me know if you guys want more videos like this. I'm more than happy to show you guys more like behind the scenes stuff of like all the photography and the filming and the stuff I do and like the kind of gear I use. And being like relatively new into this environment, like this is only my 30, well, two and a half years now of me like making videos and photography and everything and traveling. So I'm learning a lot. I'm adapting, you know, this, this whole setup is going to keep evolving. I'm going to get more camera gear and I'm probably going to dump, dump more of the clothes just to fit it. But we'll see how it goes. And um, yeah, guys, thanks for watching. So peace out. Live wild. Die fantasy, guys. Boom.